What's up everyone, just here with a quick video today. Today I'm opening the Digimon card game Tamer Set 2. Just got this in the mail a couple days ago. Nothing super big, just a play mat and sleeves, but figured I might as well open it, uh, see how it looks, and kind of just share my reaction to it. This one has an Omnimon focused uh, art on it since it was made around the time that Battle of Omni um, was coming out. So let's check out the sleeves first real quick. Same art that's going to be on the mat but pretty cool. Um, just Omnimon on the one side and Swords Defeat on the other side. I actually really like the kind of contrast. Uh, light and dark for it looked like pretty cool sleeves but let's open the actual mat it looks pretty cool so this is the mat itself looking very nice very fresh with our dual Omnimon arts let me zoom out a little to get the full view awesome so this is the mat as a whole looks pretty cool um just have this really nice actually the Omnimon art looks super awesome i love the kind of like figures for both of them and then their heads just posing heroically in the background staring off to the distance like any edgy anime protagonist so we obviously have the typical Omnimon on one side and then we have Swartz Defeat on the other side which is very cool um, to definitely one of the cooler alternate Omnimon versions it's obviously pretty straightforward just a kind of like light and good on the one side and kind of like darkness looking themed on the other side overall it's a really nice play mat i do really like the detail and designs the omnimon half specifically just looks really cool really does a good job of capturing that kind of just heroic nature he has i do like the feathers floating around kind of as a reference to the reboot of the show um and i do like the stoic heads looking off into the distance in the background and I'm actually just noticing this now, but I believe on the back of the Omnimon side, that's actually merciful mode staring out into the distance. Um, you can see the little blue highlights. And I guess that would make more sense with the feathers too, kind of like hinting at his true form um, or his ultimate form. And then on the Swords Defeat side, of course, we have a much more menacing kind of darker tone to it, which is really nice. It's cool to see both of their chest pieces glowing. Um, and I believe in the back of the Swartz Defeat side, I believe that's Alter B. Um, so kind of just the dark version of Alter S. Um, I believe that's what that form is. It would be really cool if it is, since these are those are the actual two forms of Omnimon we have yet to receive in the card game because we don't have a Merciful mode card or an Alter B, um, which I'm super looking forward to at some point in the future, I really hope. Merciful Mode is a cool card. Um, my theory is he would be maybe yellow, green, or just a rainbow colored card that could digivolve from any color, um, especially since all of the children kind of combine their powers to get him. And Alter B would probably just be another black, purple-ish Omnimon, maybe purple, red, or black, red. I do wish they would resize their playmats to the typical sizes a lot of people use in other games. Um, because if anything, I feel like these sizes kind of just discourage people from actually using them or playing them with them as much. And that might just be a personal thing for me because realistically it doesn't matter. They are obviously plenty big enough to play with the actual card game. Um, they're just on the slightly shorter side compared to a lot of the playmats you would buy out there, especially if you're buying your own custom playmats. Definitely going to be a fun mat to use if you're playing any Omnimon focus decks or maybe security control with Zwartz. And I'll probably use it in the background of some future videos. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to show off this mat real quick and the sleeves. Um, pretty cool stuff. I like that they're kind of just releasing these 
different arts with different themes in Digimon. I hope we continue to get more stuff in the future with it. Um, I hope they also kind of add more stuff. It would be nice if like they also came with like memory counters or memory gauges to put alongside these things. But I guess we're getting memory gauges. There's a lot of the other products now anyway. But yep, this is the playmat. Um, looks pretty cool overall. Honestly, I'd kind of forgotten that I got it. I just remember getting a premium Bandai package this weekend and I was like, what is this? And I had to look up and I was like, oh, okay, it's a playmat. Um, but pretty cool. Um, kind of just a short video I'm uploading while I'm finishing editing some deck profile videos. Have any of you all picked up this mat yourself or any of the other official Digimon TCG mats from premium Bandai or any of the tournaments? Let me know if you have. Let me know what your favorite ones are. But that's it, and I will see you in the next video.